Elite Boxing presents. Please welcome from Thailand, Thanong Dead Sang Summer. Tanang De up now, very experienced performer, been around a long time. Former Lumpini champion. Former Thailand champion, if my memory serves me well. Channel 7 Stadium champion so, and WBMF world champion, so no easy task for whoever has to share a ring with him tonight. So 173 centimetres height for Tanong De. 27 years old, so can't probably coming into the twilight of his career. But 90 fights, 74 wins, 16 losses, 14 KOs. See him here working hard here at the new elite boxing training facility in Bangkok. Been spared to being a state-of-the-art training facility. The fighters can prepare themselves to the best. Nice views of the, the of lower Bangkok as well. Yeah. Tenth floor. Seven times and has won seven four times. And now, please welcome from France, Chris Busuko. Chris Busuko is opponent. Seventy kilograms. He's ninety from France. Old, has fought thirty-six times and has won twenty-nine. Twenty-nine times. wins for him in his career. Out of thirty-six fights, seven losses, eight KOs. So lacking a bit experience-wise. 180 centimetres tall, so a good 7 centimetres height advantage for Greece. Oh, opening round, 70 kilos this fight. Tanong on Depp from Thailand in the black shorts with a red trim. Greece from France in the silver with the blue trim. As you can see there, clear height advantage for Greece. Yeah, it could be making things a little bit tricky for Tanong Depp with the height advantage he's got. Tanong Depp, though, very experienced, a former Lumpini champion. So he was quick to whip an elbow across the top yeah. there. You, you see, maybe. Thinking right, I'll, I'll keep the. I'm trying to perhaps intimidate this little, this uh, young Frenchman. Yeah, looking for the low kick there as well. Looking to try and chop the legs down. There's traditionally been a feeling, hasn't there, amongst uh, a lot of the ties that Europeans don't like to be, don't to be like kicked, to be kicked they don't in the legs. Like a block, and they'll always test that out. Yeah. And I think maybe he, uh, maybe he, he's thinking, he's, he's looking at his opponent, he's thinking, well, he's a tall, a tall, lean guy with sort yeah. of like quite sort of quite thin legs. You know, I'm, I'm sure he is strong, you know, but he's, his legs don't look that powerful, no. do they? So he's thinking, he's I think maybe he's thinking, with right, kicks already right, just above I'm, the knee. Yeah, I'm going to work those. I'm going to hit those legs. Looking for the punch combination, but just difficult with a fighter this tall to find a range. You see again, you know, talking about the legs and, and the, the build. Tanande, he, look, he looks strong, doesn't he? A solid low kick there from Tanande, but long rangey one two there from Chris, his opponent. Chris has really got to use that teep, use the, use the push kick, keep, yeah. keep, keep the tie back, hasn't he? Stop him advancing, use it there, and then set his hands up. Again, working the low kick to the inside leg now. Oh, yeah, Tang solid body kick from him, high kick. Oh, 
No, it's a good body kick again there from Tanong Dip. Looking like that went a little bit low there. Priest just getting a bit of time to recover. I don't think that was an intentionally low shot. And it apologises in. Hard low kick again there from Tanong Dick. Priest looking for the one two, but just Tanong Dick reading it well, just stepping back half a step out of range. And we're going to work that inside leg again. Nice exchange of punches and elbows there. No fighter really getting the better of each other. Priest switching his stunts a couple of times there. I wonder yeah, if that suggests yes, and he's, he's switching a lot from orthodox and to southpaw. I wonder if that suggests his legs are, are a little bit sore. I really think he should be setting himself up off his legs and off his kicks. He should be using his uh, a push kick every time that Tanong Dead edges forward. Got into round number one. Interesting opening round. We're going to have to follow up then. over the top of that punch and then I'll get able to land a, the, the shoulder right angle and the solid follow up. So in the uh, crease's corner there, Nasa K, the team Nasa K from St. Fons in Leon. Very, very strong gym, one of the most strongest gyms in Europe in my mind. Great fighters there, Fabio Pinker, Johan Lidden, Michael Pizzicello. Really produces a lot of strong fighters, NASA. So uh, Tanong Depp won't have an easy task in front of him. None. NASA doesn't tend to put out uh, very many weak fighters. So. And this young man, only 20 years old, yeah, so he may be a new, new, new prospect, yeah. Solid low kick again there from Tanong Depp. He's looking for the one two, but just uh, again then. Find his range, but nice knees from him in the clinch. Yeah, it's traditionally the strong point of the Thai fighters, but he's just showing there he can he can mix it in the clinch. Good arm positioning from Tenon Depp there, there though, just not allowing uh, Chris to get a position where he can pull him around. Nice hard low kick from Tenon Depp there. Ooh, Good elbow. Big elbow, elbow over the solid top. elbow there over the top. That controlling the yeah, positioning there, so. getting his arms in, controlling the inside position. Again, working those legs. He's blocking well though, but just uh, unable to find uh, the range of Tanong Depp with the follow ups. Going close with an elbow there, Tanong Depp. But again, the height of crease worked in his advantage there. Difficult for the TIE fighter to get that elbow. Up high enough. Opening up well with the punches here though, Tanong Dek just on the back foot under a bit of pressure there. The creases punches are all, are all long aren't they, they're coming from a long, a long way back. Solid long knee through the middle there from Tanong Dek. Yeah. I think Chris, Chris needs to set his punches up with kicks or set something up, disguise them a little bit. They're coming too long and Tanong Dek can see them. Into the clinch again, good positioning again there from Tanong Dek. He's got his head down low in the clinch. Solid knee there. Taking uh, Crease off his feet. And the, you know, the Challenger team are sending strong ties yeah. over to Europe, aren't they? Oh yeah, no, they, they, none of the, the guys we've seen so far are uh, uh, mugs by any means. They're real strong. Good knees in the middle from uh, Tanong Dek again there. Reese firing back, but just the heavy shots at the moment coming from uh, the TIE fighter. But that's kind of what you'd expect with the experience gap. And age as well, for 20 years old, he, he is, he's a prospect. He definitely uh, looks a strong prospect, Reese, from France. If, if he can compete with a, a top tie like this at the age of 20 and with the, the relatively few fights he's had. 
also from a very strong training background as well and a very solid gym like I said before Team Nasaka in St. Fonds in Lyon very strong a, a lot of strong fighters there the guys that fought for the Lumpini match on the title as well uh, that fought there Fabio Pinker the Thai fight champion from 2010 this is what I mean like those punches are just coming from too far away yeah, aren't they just taking a step half a step or a step back every time as he's coming in just, just, just staying a little bit out of range. Great tactics from Tanong De. He's still there in position to come back in with a fast yeah. counter. So round three. Thailand versus France in this fight. And this Thailand versus Europe battle here in the Karl Benz Arena in Stuttgart, Germany. Strong kick off the front leg there from Tanong Det. Brees him with some good knees there though, but again, just allowing uh, Tanong Det to just get himself in a strong position there and just powering those knees. Just looking for the low kick again there. Chris is getting his legs up well though to block those low kicks, so no real damage being done there. Just uh, seems to have gone into his shell a little bit now, Chris. A little bit negative. Mm. We haven't seen him kick for a while, have we, as well? Tanum Dip just uh, controlling the action, middle of the ring. Chris is just popping the odd jab out, isn't yeah, he? And he, he went he for the really elbow then, but Tanong Det in with a solid follow-up elbow and another rising one there in the clinch. He's just locking his arms in the elbows uh, sockets of uh, Chris says He's not letting him get any sort of position or movement in the clinch. He's just showing his experience and, he, and his quality, isn't he? Uh, yeah. you, know, with, with you don't win them pinny titles uh, easily. No, no. It's, it's knowing technique like that and being able to produce technique like that in the battle. Oh! Well time low kick there, just taking their legs from under Greece from France. Greece just, uh, again, they're just looking for the punch, but Lennon did just saw it coming and just came in with a solid elbow counter. Everything that Greece tries to do. Uh, Tanda has got his counter, hasn't yeah. he? You look at it. Again, looking. controlling the clinch with his arm positioning. Not allowing uh, Kreese to get any kind of solid grip. I think Sharp tactics out from Tanung De. has uh, kind of run out of ideas, hasn't he, really? How can he break down the tie? He hasn't really got the, an idea how to do it now. And I'm enjoying himself now here, and as it comes towards the last 10 seconds of the third round. Stabbing out a solid push kick there. And Creed seems to just run out of ideas a little bit now. Oh, end of round number three. Beautiful timing. He's following through with the punch there, Creed, so all the momentum going away and just Stepped off to the side, and a solid low kick took his legs away. Well, round number four coming up. It's an important money round. Let's see if Kraus is, uh, if, if uh, Kreese's corner can have been able to sort of give him some ideas. Yeah, he's starting a little bit more determined this round, looking for the punch there. I'd like to see him use his legs, use the, those long yeah. legs, that's it. Use a push kick as well. And come straight back with a kick, he's too slow with, to come back. A sharp kick off the front leg from Tunnel Dett. And again, as Chris is following in, he's just taking that half a step back, out of range, out of danger. Very smart. Reese looking with a jab now. But again, a little bit too negative on the back foot, a bit too much. He needs to be trying to 
take the fight by the scruff of its neck now and really push him forward and trying to wrestle the momentum away from Tanong Dare. He can't afford to sit back and just try and pick him off and get picked off himself. And a solid body kick from Tanong Dare. Grease opening up there, but again, out of range. Trying for the takedown, but Tanong Dare, just his experience here, managing to keep his balance and throw Grease down. Tanong Dett looking in control now this round. Reese again there, just too much on the back foot. That's it, those, those shots that are coming off the back foot, there's not a lot behind them, is there? No. There's no real impetus, and so Tanong Dett is not worried by them. And it's also, by the time he's stepped back as well, he's, he's taking even more of the impetus away. Yeah. Shot there that he's complaining it looked low, it didn't look too low to me, but a few seconds it's not to get my his groin breath. guard that so um Maybe Chris can use these few seconds to think, right, come on, what, what have I got to do? How can I get through to this guy? So action back underway. Before. I don't think they're intentional from Tanong Dett, it's more the, the height. He's just going to kick high, but. Well, also the height difference, isn't yeah. it? Just another good solid body kick as the last seconds of the fourth round. Keeping the crease at bay, totally in control here now. Oh, the bell to end the fourth. Great counter. Yes. And so again, just, just taking that half step back. Good elbow inside there from Tanong Dare. So, final round. Thailand versus France. Tanong Dek, Cheng Sim Il Jim in the red, the trimmed black shorts. Increase from France in the silver shorts. Finding his range crease at the start of this round. You know, just Tanong Dead. Tanong Dead keeps his hands up. Crease can play him another low blow. Get that point taken off him now, Tanong Dead. A little bit harsh, I think. Yeah. Of course, you know, the boxers do wear a strong, usually, in, certainly in Thailand, a metal cup to protect them uh, in the groin area. And a solid body kick there. And a hard kick there across the arms of Creases. I think he's felt them all through the fight. Mm. Oh, a bit of a show there, Tanong Dett. Again, his timing of his kicks is beautiful, yeah. isn't it? Spinning uh, crease off balance here with the momentum of that kick. It's been an excellent performance by Tanung Dead. Yeah, very comprehensive display. Just uh, 
controlled the ring well. Picked off Crease with a all those solid kicks and uh, knees throughout. Strong in the clinch and just staying back out of range every time. Just there, not to there, but not getting hit and just staying close enough to come back in. Pick Crease off with a uh, solid shot throughout. Yeah, I think right from the start, I think he thought, right, I can see this guy's this guy is tall and, and and lean. I'm going to hit his legs, take away and you know hopefully take away some of his mobility in the first round, which yeah. he did. And also so, intimidate I mean, him a little bit. Intimidate him, yes. I mean, how, we haven't really seen Crease doing a lot of kicking, have we? Really. No. But I would say that the that you know you can see some potential increase though. And, oh yeah, uh, he's, he's only young. He's uh, he's got great build. Yeah, if he keeps keep keeps it going. You know, maybe in a couple of years' time. You know, I'm sure we'll if he can keep it going for a couple of years. We'll, I'm sure we'll see him on on the big promotions. So ten seconds left. Good solid body kick from Tanong Dede. He's just looking and to again. move around now. Stay out of any uh, trouble. Solid knee through the middle and the bell to end the fight. Nice show of respect from both fighters for each other there. Very small movements yeah. at Tanong Day does just to keep himself Half out of trouble. It's, uh, it's no more than that. Very effective throughout. So to see which way the judges saw and the fight. For the second fight of tonight from Thailand. Yeah, we're getting another clear win for Thailand. Again, no real surprise there.